guys, I want to make a really quick video um, here about the web shooter I've just finished. Um, no, this is not uh, using CO2, even though that looks like a CO2. Um, this is just a solenoid valve web shooter. Um, it's pretty much the exact same design as the Amazing. Um, so if you want to see a tutorial or better pictures of it, check out his channel. I'll post a link in the description. Uh, I did make a few, a few uh, minor, um, just uh, just changes to it, I guess, uh, for my own design. Um, but pretty much, it's it's pretty much uh, the same of his, his newest version. I think that's his Mark III. I'm not sure. Um, but yeah, so here it is. I don't have any web fluid in the canister right now. This is that's what that CO2 thing is. That's just where I put the web fluid. Um, so this clicking sound is just the solenoid valve opening and closing. Uh, like I said, I did change things up a bit. Um, what it's on, I actually made, um, and I'll show you that later. Um, so that's one of the changes. Also, the other change is up here. Also added this really awesome uh, laser to it. Well, not a laser. It's just a it's just a little LED light. But as you can see, pretty cool. It actually goes pretty far. Sweet. Um, we don't have to wire that in there separately. Uh, so yeah, let me break it down to you. So this is the battery. All right, and then this is the actual web shooter. All right, this is uh, where I keep my web fluid. Actually, the amazing came up with this invention. Freaking awesome. So a lot of this credit is basically um, just his. Um, um, because he's just a brilliant mind and like I said check out his channel he'll show you how to make this and everything if you want a tutorial to make one for yourself um, it's just a CO2 with um, just this connector that's been on to it and then I added a little sleeve here um, just to handle um, when I you know after I take it out of the freezer and stuff when it's cold uh, this is the solenoid valve I just wired some stuff up to here and there's a little button right here that I press I can't press it now because there's no battery. And then I have the LED right there. And this is just all very early on. I'm sure I'll actually find a place to put it, but I've just kind of taped everything on for now. All right, and this right here is this fun little thing I made. Uh, it's just to absorb some of the impact um, that the web shooter has on my wrist. It's just nylon string with two buckles. Let's see. And then right here, it's this really soft, um, it's not necessarily styrofoam, uh, it's like packaging, really. I just uh, kind of cut out a square piece of that, I glued it to my nylon band, and then I got this uh, cardboard, and then I, got, uh, then I got that glued on to the packaging, alright, and then I just taped it all up, so it'd be really together put together it's very sturdy actually and then I added this um, ledge here this little guy right here so that when the web shooter fits onto it screw that back on just fits perfectly just like that and then when the battery is on those and it just pops back on that ledge so that these remain touching it, if I'm lucky, there we go, nice touching it, yep, but that's it for now, hope you enjoyed this quick update, and for now, spectacular out, see you guys.